All righty, back with another construction update. So a lot happened. I'm really shocked because there was that little remnants of that hurricane that passed over, which equated to a lot of rain, um, but it did not slow the construction team down. So they pre-did all those caissons that I was talking about in yesterday's video. So if you look here, entering into the mountain area, uh, they did the caissons and over on the break run, um, they did a really tall caisson, and I'll explain what that means as soon as it comes up on the screen. Again, there is still very little work going on in this area, and that's probably because of the flooding. So it's probably going to take a couple days before they get back to work there. But who knows? This construction team seems to be moving really quickly. All right, right here. So you see that rebar cage coming really high up out of the ground? Well, it looks like it could end up being a really tall caisson, which is probably going to mean that the support column is going to go up above that building, um, furthermore, hinting at it staying. So my guess would be the break run's going to pass over that building, hinting at a really tall break run. Obviously, it's got to come over Vortex somehow, um, so the ride is probably going to be really high at the end. Again, you know what that means. This ride's going to have a lot of speed at the end. Take that as a really good sign. It's a very long ride. We're looking at 3,400 feet minimum without a lift hill <coughs> and a short break run. Oh, my God. Um, so they install the garage door. I'm telling you right now, we're not going to be able to see in the mountain. Wonderland is not allowing anyone to see in the mountain. They've installed the garage door on tunnel two, tunnel three. They've piled up the dirt even higher. So you can't see, um, even weirder. Some surveying was going on in the extreme sky flyer bottle land. That's really weird timing, but oh, well, um, over here in the action theater area, this weird shipping containers arrived. Um, I have a feeling it's probably for the kids fest. It just has a really dark theme, so maybe it's going to be one of the DC or Marvel characters that they have there. Um, but these shipping containers arrived. This is from United Rentals. This is a company that Wonderland's been using um, for the, when they were storing pieces for the water slide. So I have a feeling those containers are going into the mountain, and they were sitting in the parking lot waiting for the park to close to transport them in into the mountain so no one could see. Anyways, thanks so much for watching today's construction update. Um, stay tuned for tomorrow's, and if you're impatient or you want to see a different perspective, definitely subscribe to us on Patreon as uh, I am starting video formatted uh, construction up updates for my Patreons as well. Thanks so much, guys. Bye.